Good morning everybody, welcome to the day. It's another new day, we are in Quebec and we're headed to New Brunswick today. Sergeant, you have a good night? You have a good night? You had a great night, didn't you? Looks like it. Diesel, did you sleep well? That very well, thank you. Thank you. You guys uh need to go to the old word? The old word? Oh, I know what that one is, man. Oh, I know it. Outside? Yeah? Wanna go outside? Diesel, wanna go outside? Don't tease me, man. Alright, let's go outside and let's get going. Diesel, my sandwich. My sandwich. Got my trusty Chevy hat right here. Right there, so that I don't forget. I'm being watched. My sandwich, got my Knoxo. Shades, don't forget the shades. Where are the shades? Okay, maybe I'll put them down here. Okay. All right, here we go. Everything's ready to go. Brakes are already pushed in. I'm holding them with my foot. Oh, oh, I need to clean these windows again. Guys, you leave your nose art all over everything every night. Oh, well, I can still see through them. I just want to get going right now. Wait, 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 wait. Gotta do the logbook. Gotta do the logbook. Look that way. Look that way. All right. Gas pedal. Signal. Lights. Here we go. Here we go. You guys ready? Da 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 da. Stop looking at me like that. I sing sometimes. You shouldn't do that, man. Okay. Signal. Signal device has been activated. Excuse me. Pardon me. Drunk Josh entering the highway. Get out of the way. All right, here we go. All right, here we go. Officially on the highway. So we are between Montreal and Quebec City, Quebec. Uh, but actually, we're closer to Quebec City. We're only about a half hour from Quebec City. Uh, we slept near Villeroy, Quebec. We're going to be going up and around the state of Maine on the Canadian side and uh, down into uh, New Brunswick. And that's that. The day has officially begun. All right, first break, just a little ways down the road here. Get this window cleaned off. Driving me nuts, all your nose art on there, Sergeant. Don't lick that, that's Windex, it's not for me. Oh, wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. Much better, much better. Let's see. Much better. So I just stopped about an hour down the road from where we began this morning. Uh, here at the Petro Canada. I see a Tim Hortons across the road over there. Right there. This guy's gonna block our view right away. It's great timing. And we're at this Petro Canada right here. Looks like they got a restaurant over there and everything. I am a little hungry. So I'm gonna go check out this restaurant. See what they got going on here. Seems like this is their entrance here. I don't know what that is. I probably gotta go in the front. I, that door was locked, so I probably gotta go in the front. It makes sense that I'd go in the front, right? That did seem like a kind of sketchy rear entrance. 
Oh, this looks a lot better. This looks more like a bedroom. I think it's safe to say you wouldn't want to light a cigarette in this truck. <laughs> That's made completely out of straw. Yeah. Fascinating. <laughs> you don't want to go too fast in it either, it'll just fly apart. Sometimes it's just very nice and brotherly to share one bed, isn't it? Yeah, I'm not really sharing, man. He sort of just fell on me. He does what he wants. He doesn't, he doesn't get in my face, man. Get, Sergeant, get off of him. What are you? He doesn't like that. Yeah, I don't like it, man. It's okay, Diesel. I got your back. Got your back. Yeah, he's he's a puppy. He's got to learn. He's got lots to learn, man. Lots. Okay, you guys can't both lay in the same bed. That's just weird, all right? All right, there you go. That's right. Kick him in the head. You're going to stay there. Leave him alone. Sergeant, you have a habit of bugging him. You never leave him alone. Okay? He loves you, but he doesn't love you that much. <laughs> Sounded kind of mean coming out. Good thing you're tough. You can take it. You can take it. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Put your Chevy right there. Oh, this thing's... Screw that is. That doesn't go anywhere. Okay. Ready to go. Are you ready to go? Are you ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? We're ready. Are you ready? Okay, let's get out of here. It's gonna be, we're gonna be driving into the night. I don't have to be there till Monday, remember, but got another six hours of driving to go yet. Meander our way right through here, thread the needle. Nice and slow, you don't wanna go flying through the pumps. Oh, I didn't see these arrows there. Oh well, I'm a rebel. I go against the grain. Whoops. Oh, well, next time we know. I don't think it matters. There's no one there right now. But... Okay, this road is busy. I, I, I walked across the Tim Hortons over there to get these honey crullers. Oh, it took me forever just to get across the road. But we might have just gotten lucky. Oh, and we get to enter the road right away. So how about that? It took me like 15 minutes to get across the road before when I was walking. Come in a big truck, suddenly everybody gets out of the way. Is this where I want to go? Do I want to go this way? I think I want to go this way. Mandy, why are you not talking to me? Talk to me, Mandy. Fine. Just get lost on my own. Here we go. Are you guys ready? Come on, we're trying to get up the highway speed before we hit the highway. I think I can, I think I can, I think I can, I think I can. 70 kilometers an hour, speed limit's 100 on the highway. But then they put these tight corners in here so we can't go very fast. Okay, okay, here we go, here we go. Five eighty-five kilometers on North 20 East. Now she tells me where to go. I'm already on the road, Mandy, but thanks. Come on, give her, give her, give her, give her, give her, give her, give her. Oh, I forgot to wash my mirror, shoot. Oh, I'll have to do that at the next stop now fully in the lane doing exactly 100. Perfect. <coughs> like I'm a professional or something. I don't know. So I'm just here parked uh, in New Brunswick. We just got into New Brunswick and I'm trying to figure out where I am and where I'm going to uh, sleep tonight. 
Got my smartphone out here because it's way smarter than me. I gotta look on the map. I'm thinking of staying at the Salisbury uh, Irving over in uh, by Moncton there. I gotta see how far away from St. John that is though. Okay, so this is where we are right now. We're uh, just barely into New Brunswick, just above the state of Maine. You see me way over there? See where my home is? A little beep, 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 right there. I'm way over here. And I went up here at Quebec City. I came around the top of Maine. And we're literally like right on the border of Maine right now. Like there's a river just off here to our right. Maine is right over there. Isn't that interesting? So this is the province of New Brunswick here. All of this. And we're going to come down this little road right here. And there's St. John. So Moncton is way out of the way. We can't go to Moncton and stay there. Hmm. What's over here? Oh, Fredericton. Okay. As I, I've never been down to St. John, so I, I don't know if there's any uh, good truck stops there or not. And I don't really want to risk it. I do know, though, that there is a nice little truck stop here. This is the border crossing into Maine. This is Woodstock, New Brunswick. I know that you come into Woodstock here, you go around this little bend, and I think it's around here, there's a nice little truck stop. Irving. Oh no, this is the Esso. Okay. That is a truck stop. That is one place I could stay. I'd like to go a little bit further than that, though, you know? So, that little blue dot is us. And I've just typed in... Irving Big Stop Travel Plaza, because on the East Coast in the Maritimes, Irving is the big thing, sort of like Flying J and Husky, but it's Irving. Uh, so these are all the travel plazas, and we want to go down here to St. John. St. John, right here, St. John, and it looks like there's one right in St. John. Rothsay Circle K Travel Plaza, and this is how I find out where I'm going to spend the night. You can see that there's a decent amount of truck parking there, not much. So hopefully it's not busy there. Otherwise I might not have a spot to park or I might have to make a spot to park, you know what I mean? But So we can go and park here. Uh, let's see what this looks like in Google Earth. Just so that we can get a front, front head or a front on view so that we know what we're looking at. Uh, like I said, this is how I find where I'm going. Okay, so this is the truck stop here, right? We're gonna take this little dude. Oops, hey, hey. We're gonna take this little dude. We're gonna grab him and pull him down, put him on the road. And flip our phone over this way. And this is what the, that road looks like. And there is the Circle K Irving. You can zoom in on it. Looks like they got a nice little store there. Maybe even a, a restaurant. Okay, and how much truck parking do they have? Okay, not the most, but let's move down the street here just a bit. Double tap the screen. Okay. So this is what we're looking at for truck parking from the road. Looks like you can fit 20 to 30 trucks in that lot comfortably. So if we go right now, hopefully we'll get a spot there. That's where we're going to head to tonight. Okay, so I just punched in the new information, we're going from down there, right along the border with Maine, all the way down to St. John there. Let's go back. And we've got 341 kilometers to go. And we're on Highway 2. Alright, so let's get going. Sergeant, what are you doing? Oh, it's diesel. Okay, diesel. <laughs> uh, I thought that was you. All right, here we are in New Brunswick. Okay. You done shaking? Here we are in New Brunswick. The sun has gone down. We have two hours left to go to St. John. The highways are nice. The weather is reasonably nice. It's getting a little cool though at night. Let's see what the temperature is outside right now. Plus three Celsius, that's about 35 Fahrenheit. Just 
going down a hill here. So hopefully there will be room for us at that Irving Travel Plaza. That's the only thing I'm worried about. Just going past downtown St. John, New Brunswick here. I've never been here before. This city's way bigger than I thought it was. Wow. I love coming to new places. You know, as you spend more and more time on the road, there's fewer and fewer places that are new, right? This is one place that's uh, still new to me. St. John. Is St. John the capital? No, Moncton's the capital, isn't it? I don't know. This is actually a very nice city. It's like a, a seaside city. What do you call that? The big cargo ships come in here. I just passed the dock a little while ago. Very nice. Very nice. Exit right to McGuire Road. Alright, here we are. We're just arriving at the Irving. That guy has his high beams on over there. But since it's a four-lane highway, there uh, must be some kind of barrier between him and me that he thinks it doesn't blind me, but that's right. Okay, so here we are. Here we are, guys. Let's see if it looks like just like it did in uh, Google Maps there, Google Earth. This is where I go in. This is where I go in. Was this the truck entrance? Where do the trucks go? Do the trucks go through the back? I need to get to the other side of this building. Doesn't look like they'll have showers in this little building here, but. And that's it, boys. That is it. We are here. Gonna be taking a reset here too. There's lots of grass out there I saw where you can run around tomorrow. Oh, it's gonna be fun. Oh, you see Sergeant's face running? I like running. Running's my favorite. I like it. It's lots of fun. Actually, it's my second favorite. Treats are my favorite. Treats and then running. How are you, Diesel? You just like life, don't you? Come here. Both of you, come here. How are you doing? Can you sit? I like the little spin first, just for show. Hey, you showing off a bit, man. You, you do the spin? Sergeant, you want to come too? Sergeant, don't be a party pooper. Sergeant, come here. Oh, I'm down. Come. Here, can you both sit? You don't need to push Diesel out of the way. Okay, sit. Diesel, you two, come here and sit. Come on. I want to get them both here, right beside me, and they're not doing it. Because every time I sit beside him, he bites my face. See what I mean? See what I mean, man? He bites my face. Oh, okay, okay. And then you compete for the pets, I know. And you keep stealing my pets, man. Nice shirt. <laughs> I have this little LED blue light here that shines from there into the bunk to provide a little ambient lighting for at night so I can see what they're doing if I need to. Aren't right, you good boys? Good boys. <laughs> you guard the truck well, okay? I've never been here before. I don't know if it's safe or not. It's New Brunswick, I'm pretty sure it's safe. Probably don't even need to lock the doors. Thanks for tagging along today. Glad you could come with. Tomorrow's another day. We're gonna be right here around St. John, New Brunswick. Not too sure what we're gonna do. I wanna get a lot of work done with the vlog tomorrow. Uh, it'll probably be a full day's work of that, but I'm gonna make sure we get out, get some exercise, do something interesting. You know, it's not every day you're out here in New Brunswick, so we'll, we'll figure out. We can't go far, right? I can't leave them here for very long by themselves and uh, just venture out by myself. But I can promise you one thing. We're going to go into that restaurant there tomorrow and get something to eat. I did even go in there right now. I don't know if they're still open or not. But I'm going to end the vlog anyways. I'll see you tomorrow, anytime after 4 a.m. Central Time. Don't forget to go down below to the description. There's a whole pile of links down there if you press the Show More button that you can uh, click past vlogs of mine, what I've been doing on this day up to two years ago. Also, the monthly giveaway draw for the patrons is coming up soon. 
the way that works is we do the patron draw at the towards the end of the month in the last two weeks of the month after all the pay, the pledges have been processed and then after your pledge has been processed you get your name put into the draw for the giveaway prize and we're going to be revealing tomorrow what the prize is going to be looking forward to that i'll see you then